In this section, we are going to see how a compact model can be added to the custom library in Interconnect. We will start with the project file containing the compact model we developed for a ring modulator. First, we will select the icon for the compact model. We can do this by right-clicking the compound element and selecting Set Icon. This will open up a browser window where we can browse and select the vectorgraphics.svg file containing the icon for the compact model. Next, we will set the model name and prefix for the compound element. The model property of the element will be used as the name for the corresponding model inside the custom library. It is therefore best to pick a unique and appropriate model name for each element. Note that if the model name value is left empty, the name value above is automatically used for the model name of the element. The prefix is usually a short name given to the element. For example, the prefix for the waveguide straight element is WGD, so when a new waveguide is added, its name is set to WGD underscore 1 or WGD underscore 2, and so on. For our ring modulator, we will set the name of the element to ring modulator and the prefix to RM. We will now set the folder for the custom library. We can do this by redirecting the custom folder to the desired location. Next, select the compact model, right click and select copy to element library. You can see that the ring modulator element is now available inside the custom folder. We can also open up the location of the custom library to see the corresponding .ice file that has been created. Once the compact model is added to the custom folder, we can generate a .html help file by right-clicking on the corresponding model in the element library and selecting Export HTML. The .html file has the same name as the model name. While creating the compact model, we can save the address of the HTML file in the URL parameter. If we do this, then the end user will be able to open up the help file for a compact model by simply right-clicking on the compact model and selecting Help. To demonstrate this, we will go into the property editor of the compact model and set the value for the URL parameter with the path of the .html file. We will then send the model uh, again to the custom folder. Now, if we add the ring modulator compact model to our schematic and click on help, the help file will open in the browser.